Good morning, everybody. Today, we are going to go over two things. We're going to, I'm going to go over eighth rests, which are just for percussion, but everyone can learn them. And then we're going to go over syncopated rhythms, which is um, for everybody on this one. Um, so percussion first. If you've never seen a percussion part before, there's there's two lines a lot of times, okay? And we're just reading the top notes of the top line. The top notes of the top line, okay? And so we've seen eighth notes. They look like this. They look like this. All of us have seen them. We learned, we learned some of those eighth note songs in chapter three. And now we have a single eighth note by itself. It's over here at the beginning. That kind of looks like if I took, if I get rid of the second note here and the, the top part just fell down. That's how I like to imagine it. So those single eighth notes are worth one half of a beat. When we count eighth notes, we count one and two and three and four and, okay? Um, and each of these symbols, an eighth note, eighth rest, it looks like a seven, that means rest for half a beat. Eighth note, eighth note, eighth note, eighth rest, eighth note, eighth note are half a beat. So I was clapping this measure. Remember, claps are together, rests are apart. I would clap one and two and three and four and so they're each the same speed i just rest on the on the end notes so one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and and the chord notes are a full three and four and if i'm playing it on the drums i know you can't see my drum pad we're close ready and one and two and three and four and okay it has right right left right right left which i didn't do the reason it has that okay is so that you can fake hit almost on the rest right left right left right left right left kind of to give yourself the sense that you hit with your left hand okay like we're still alternating beats Right, rest, right, left, right, rest, right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. That was the first two measures there. Okay. Um, the other tricky one is measure seven over here. So we have one and two, sorry, one and two and three and four and. Okay. And that looks trickier than it is. It's just flam, rest, flam, rest, quarter rest, flam. So we have flam, flam, rest, flam, flam, two, and three. I'll play that for you as their part as well. Okay, that was a little bit faster than we're going, but that's all right. Slow that down for next time. So that's our eighth rest. We'll do one more eighth rest, and it's going to be on 2.20. So I'm just counting my eighth rests. And here's the same thing. One and two and three and four and. So I'm just counting my one and two and three and four and. Try just doing the counts right now. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and clap it, but you just count. Just count one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and just count out loud. I'm gonna do the first two measures, okay? Ready, go. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and easy. It's just eighth notes in an eighth rest. Now you try clapping with me. Everybody, including wind players. Ready? Two, you gotta count two. One and two and three and four. One and two and three and four. And one and two and three and four. And if you weren't looking at the music while you did that, either on the screen or on your paper, you need to be looking at the music, not at me. Let's try one more time. Ready? Go. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and and then for percussion it just does the same thing again the same thing again and basically the same thing again a little different okay if i'm playing one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and do you see i'm kind of fake hitting on those rests i'm kind of just to keep it consistent Right, left, right, left, right, 
the left to right, even though I'm not hitting with that right hand on the rest. And then our last thing is wind players doing, doing a syncopated rhythm. So we have our beat street on 2.19, which is the same rhythm as 2.20. It's not too tricky. We're counting our, we're back to just counting one, two, three, four for this. Okay. And we just have a half note on beat two. So beat two and three are a half note. So here's how that sounds. One, two, count out loud with me while I clap. One, two, three, four. 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 Now go ahead and count while you clap this time. I'm going to play the track to keep it going for us. One, two, three, four. 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 This try time, try playing your instrument along with it. Percussion on the snare drum. Or you could play your, your instrument on a B flat, your bells. Flutes on a B flat. Trumpet on a C. Trombone, baritone on a B flat. French horn on F. Clarinet on C. Alto sax on G. Try playing every note is that one note, okay? All the way through. Then go to shoe fly. And it's going to be the same rhythm with different notes. All right, looking forward to hearing what you guys do.